Hello, welcome to HIT. My name is Mary. You just need a set of dumbbells. Whatever size is best for you is totally fine. You can also use a couple cans of food if you don't have dumbbells with you. Or you can go without, totally fine. All of those are options. Please listen to your body, modify the exercises to make them work for you and to be the right amount of challenge. Way to show up. Let's get started with a warm up. I... Squats, that, that's what I meant to say. Let's do squats. Knees and toes in line. Shoulders back and down. A couple more. And then you can balance or hold on to something for leg swings, front and back. of the mat, bending our knees and just walking out to plank and back to squat and out to plank and squat a couple more times, keeping core engaged and once more. Very good. All right, let's stay on the floor for our first exercise we have opposite arm and leg reach and then together so reach keep the core engaged and together for extra challenge you can do elbow to knee and pause up top before coming back rather than swinging the arm and the leg super controlled
Holding on the back toe. Three more. Other side. more on this side. Well done. Going back to the floor. Opposite arm and leg lift. And then optional elbow to knee.
Next exercise, we'll use both weights. Coming onto our backs for this, starting with the weights over our chest, bending the elbows as we bring the weights to the sides, and then back up in front of our chest. The straighter your arms are, the more challenging it's going to be, so be just careful at first. Try with bent arms, and if you feel comfortable, then you can have your arms a little straighter. Sit up and reach overhead. Slowly roll back and then chest fly. Sit up. Very good. to the side. Coming up, and we're pretending like we have a ball again, and we're throwing it to the corners, keeping our elbows up in the air. So we're snapping at the elbows. Core engaged here for about 20 more seconds. Powerful throw is going to be a little bit more challenging. Three, two, and time. And then jacks, you can step side to side like this, or you can do full jacks here for 30 seconds.
five, three, two, and time. And then jacks, either stepping side to side or full jacks, 30 seconds. Doing great. seconds. Three, two, and time. Well done. Okay, weights again. You can either have one foot down behind you or you can balance on one leg, keeping arms straight. We're pressing the weights behind us, pausing for a couple seconds, then slowly lowering. So press back, pause, squeezing through the shoulder blades and keeping shoulders down. Two more with this leg down and then we'll switch sides. Switch. Really important to not swing the dumbbells, rather to press back, pause at the top, even if it's just for a half a second, it's better than swinging. Three more on this side. Great. Keeping one dumbbell. down, lifting overhead, and reaching down. Here for 20 more seconds. to touch the floor, but you can if that's comfortable for you. Here for whoop, 30 seconds. one weight down, picking up the dumbbell, reaching overhead, and coming to the other side. If your arms are a bit too tired, you can do it without weights or you can get a lighter weight. more 
seconds. the jump or we can do our squat jump lifting off the floor and then if you're comfortable with it adding a front and back movement just landing softly each time you choose how far you jump just make sure you keep it controlled Pausing each time to make sure we have our balance. 10 seconds. Three, two, and time. Whew, okay. Picking up our dumbbell again. Single leg balance. Lifting in front. Way to go, guys. Sides. 
more super tight. It's gonna help prevent feeling it in your lower back. Five seconds. And time. Picking up your other dumbbell. We have rear lunge and curtsy lunge. We've got this. Seconds. Three, two, switching sides. Way to stick with it, guys. We're coming up on a break. Ten seconds. Three, two, and time. Oh, well done. Okay, take a break. All right, guys, we're going to go through one more time done all the exercises so they're familiar we can modify now that we know exactly what they are we can also progress them maybe adding some more height if we're doing a jump all those are options listen to your body all right we're starting with bird dog or the opposite arm leg reach here we go pausing up top Squeezing through the back and the glutes. Pressing the heel back behind us. Two more on this side. Switch sides. Very good. Come up to standing. One dumbbell. Turning, passing to the side. But hold tight to the dumbbell. Don't let it go. Three more. And switch sides.
up our dumbbells, we're going to our chest fly on the floor, and then sit up. Starting with the weights above the chest. feel like in your arms, so just make sure you're ready for the extra challenge if you straighten out your arms a little bit. up to standing, we can place our weights down. Overhead throws, keeping the elbows up in the air, here for about 30 seconds. Powerful throw, like you're really trying to get it far and fast. And then jumping jacks, either stepping side to side or full jacks, 30 seconds. Trying to keep shoulders relaxed, core tight. Once more on the 
side. Switch. Two more. Very good. Two dumbbells now. We have our rear lunge and curtsy lunge. I know this one burns a little bit. 15 more seconds here. Switching legs. We can do it. About ten more seconds. Three, two, and time. And guys, we are at our final exercise. Before we cool down, this is the front and back squat jump, or just lifting the heels. Here we go. 30 seconds. Halfway through. Five. Three. Two and time. Ooh, very good. Breathe, step it up. Let's go into stretching. Hip flexor stretch, tucking hips under, pressing the hips forward, core is engaged. Stretch, pressing heel down, feet parallel. Other side. above the knee, stretching the outer hip. Other side. Wide legs. Flat back, walking the chest over to one side, hamstring stretch. Going to the other side. Back to the center. You can use your wall or you can go to the floor. But this is flat stretch, side of the palm. Feeling this along the side of the back and in the chest and shoulder as well. Other side.
are done. Way to push through, way to get your workout in. I hope you're doing well. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Take good care of yourself. I'll see you next time.